With the right computer algorithms, I can hack you back in time. Just like a time machine. Well then, it's hacking time. Is tinkering dead? I came across an article recently that said tinkering is dead. Or at least is dying. Like when I first got started with all this interneting stuff, I more or less taught myself HTML by way of Dreamweaver and GeoCities. Remember those? I do the view source code thing on sites to try to copy elements that I saw that I liked for things like marquee text, uh, rollover images, and mapping different parts of an image to link to different things. Sign my guestbook. Now people just load up something like WordPress, download a theme, and practically use it straight out of the box. Or maybe they'll install a plugin or play around with a WYSIWYG interface with drag and drop modules like they do on Wix or Squarespace. Not a sponsor. The tinkering element isn't really there. Not nearly as much. So long story slightly less long, here we are. Let's Start Coding has a series of little coding kits that are designed to help kids learn about coding and it's mostly geared towards children around ages eight and up. Now, Addie isn't quite eight years old yet, so I'll do a little bit of uh, tinkering on my own and hopefully bring her along for the ride. The idea is that you can hook these up to your computer. There are apps for Windows, Mac, and Chromebooks. So what they sent along for me is the Code Rocket. It's a little rocket ship. So let's go ahead and unbox this and see how it works. So what we have here is the code rocket. As you can see here, it says you can make sound effects on the speaker, control the LED lights, and code the buttons for interactions. Learn computer coding with online projects and hands-on electronics. On the side here, it says launch into coding by controlling the rocket's lights, buttons, and speaker, ages eight and up, no experience required, the kit includes the code rocket board, a USB cable, and code reference cards. So you can kind of tell based on the size relative to my hands here, uh, the code rocket itself is smaller than a traditional deck of cards, I'd say. Uh, yeah, a little bit smaller than a regular deck of cards. Take this off. How about I put that right there? And then this opens up, like so. So that's the code rocket board itself. It's a regular PCB board. You can see, let's start coding on the back there. And all the components are clearly labeled, numbered, to make it easy for kids and the young at heart like me learning coding. Uh, to play with this little device. Here is a USB uh, A cable with the female to male connection. As you can see on the code rocket here, there is the USB connection there. Another little piece here that says let's start coding.com with the code rocket. And I believe this just fits onto here so that the code rocket can stand up. Does it fit through here? Let's see. Ah, oh, yes. There we go. So it just fits through the little slot there. And lines up. And you've got yourself a little code rocket. USB cable and a series of reference cards here. Made for you, Let's Start Coding was started by parents, educators, and engineers who want to expose beginners to the magical world of coding the fun way, hands-on. Our goal is to build en engaging kits that teach valuable skills. If the kit is challenging, that's a good sign. It means you're learning. And then a series of information cards uh, for some basic coding. So it looks like I've got my hands full here with a lot of code. I'll get this connected to the Chromebook and we'll see how that turns out. Oh, there we go. 
Okay, so now that I'm on the upload this program page, upload your code. Ah. Test over different things, so what if I do five, four, I switch it to four, and I upload the code. It turned on number four. Nine and ten. Cool. So this is talking about how to make the lights blink with delays. And making multiple lights work. And then it gets more and more complicated as you learn more and more of the syntax for the code. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and wrap things up there. Thank you so much for tuning in and a big thank you to the good people at Let's Start Coding for setting us up with the code rocket here to try out. As always, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.